chi mày I know I enjoy watching you put your microphone on. It rotates. Yep. It rotates. Hi, I'm Eric the Red. I'm Rick Chateau. And this is, is news, news for the caffeinated. You know, I kind of like doing them back to back like this. Yeah, I mean, it, it kind of breaks the continuity for people that may be not watching them in order. But. I like how you said you were going to go change your shirt so you made it to make it look like it was filmed on a different day, and you just covered it up, and I'm ruining everything! <laughs> well, it was mainly I wanted something that was easier to clip this thing onto because it's meant to clip to a lapel, which is why it's a lapel mic. And I still have no lapels, but I still have the mic. I'm a fraud. <laughs> it's okay, I won't let tell about your lapels. Shh. I'm erasing the past minute of my life from my memory. All right, well, to get rid of that memory, we're going to introduce something that's hopefully fantastic. Yes. Uh, back when I went to Rhode Island Comic Con and rediscovered the mythical orange Lazarus that came back to roost. Is that I also No, it's not. That's what okay. I call it. Okay, okay. Um, because it was... Because it was you brought, thought it was gone. Because it was brought back from the dead. And, yes. And alongside it, in the convenience store shelf, was another Rockstar beverage, Rockstar Juiced. This one came in a, uh, a corrugated steel patterned can. But this also is a um, advertised tropical passion fruit beverage. Um, For that It's not quite the same fruit blend as the other one, which was mango orange passion fruit. This is tropical passion fruit. But I'm hoping, uh, I'm hoping that it'll be just the same kind of quality as that drink, because that one... As far as I can remember, that's been the only solid 10 drink that we've Yeah, since we've brought this back and uh, turned it yes. into a YouTube series. Um, that is, to date, the drink to beat. I'm going to say, I'm a little disappointed in Rockstar. You could have done actual corrugated steel. How brutal would that have been? That would have oh. been awesome, and I never would have had accidentally dropped the can. You have to open this can with a drill press. <laughs> And welcome to Hydraulic Press Channel. Today we are opening a can of Rockstar. It is very dangerous and could energize you at any time. And how about now for that So time? we must deal with it. I'm just wanting... We just finished recording the, um, the Bob Marley One Drop coffee drinks. And so, wasn't feeling properly caffeinated from that. This smells amazing. I also have to say that passion fruit seems to be a very popular flavor that's finding its way into energy drinks lately, and I am not complaining. It is a fantastic flavor and a fantastic aroma, and I think it's perfect. Ever eat plain fat passion fruit? Hmm? Ever eat plain passion fruit, like, itself? Yeah, like, the flavor of passion fruit is finding its way into a lot of drinks. I'm saying, I don't think I've ever eaten a passion fruit. I don't think I have either. I don't think I've had a bite of a passion fruit. <laughs> I've just had a lot of things that say they taste like it. If so. you threw a bunch of fruits in front of me and said, name the passion fruit, I'd have to use process of elimination. That's dragon fruit. That's ugly fruit. That's star fruit. I guess that one's the passion fruit. For all I know, it could look like two people fucking, and that's why they call it a passion fruit. <laughs> all right, so here it looks like in the can. It's um, sort of a pale straw orange color. For some reason, I expected something maybe pinkish or reddish. Um, but in any case, we'll put a picture of uh, what a passion fruit actually looks like up on the screen so you can see. Learning but and sharing. I almost get some peach out of it. Yeah. Just out of the aroma. But no, it, it looks good. It smells fantastic. The interesting thing is we're probably going to have a series in a row about passion fruit because last week... Like I said, it's finding its way into a lot of drinks right well, now. Well, we already recorded the uh, amp passion fruit yep. flavor, so keep an eye out for that. That'll be an on-location news for the caffeinated. We have another uh, slight different twist to how we do things here, but... Mm -hmm. But this one is juiced, not energy drink with yep. passion fruit And this flavor. is a full sugar beverage, so for transparency there... Um, it's got uh, how much 25 sugar? grams of carbs. Um, Interestingly enough, much less than Bob Marley One Drop. Yeah, and a much bigger container, too. So they, Rockstar, you do more with less, and you give us more, too. Well, it's a bigger container, but two, two servings per can. Yep. 
And it's also um, one of their 160 milligram caffeine drinks as opposed to the zeros, which are 240. So. Oh, I thought it was a lot at first. <laughs> I can't remember numbers. Brr. But of course, then again, there's the uh, ingredient list full of niacin, mamide, L-carotene, nicetol, and blah, 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 potassium, sucralose, etc., etc. So, Rockstar's great in the chemically caffeinated world. Yep. But it's also, it's it's sweetened with sugar, glucose, and fruit juices, and no corn syrup. So that's a good that's a good plus as well. Let's get drinking. Yeah, I'm, I'm waiting. All right. Sleep when we're dead. Ooh. Uh. It's got a great uh. finish to it. Mm. It approaches the territory of a waxy candle, but it stops just before you think you're drinking a waxy candle because you don't want to get wax in your mouth do you you know those moments in a movie where somebody tries heroin the first time and then the camera is staying with the person but everything else in the scene is falling away from them and you just see them go this is my heroin <laughs> meaning it's a woman that has saved somebody's life Oh, play. this rock star is a dirty girl. Uh, this is a fucking good beverage. Mm, this is fantastic. I can't Let's see apple juice, orange juice. Um... All right, so they're calling it passion fruit, but there's still plenty of other juices in it. So it does have orange juice. Tell me, there's some mango in here, just so we can call them out on the bullshit. There is. No. There's salt. <laughs> doesn't taste salty nope the only actual juice in here is apple and orange everything else is just extract liar. Liar. yeah but look what they were able to do with it oh my god it's fantastic but why does Maybe it it's because it's partially produced with genetic engineering <laughs> we've crossed these... rock star is people <laughs> he's pouring us he's drinking us If you had managed to drink it while screaming, I would be really impressed. <laughs> Made with the most caffeinated of fruity people. <laughs> they take that pure, unhinged it's energy that have. kids have and just boil it down. And squeeze into, them! Into a syrupy solution. They Pound charge into cans. Into corrugated steel them. cans that they then sell to adults who just want to feel normal. <laughs> And then the adults will be so caffeinated they'll want to fuck, producing more children to make into more Rockstar juiced. More, I say. It's a good fucking drink. It is. This is. <laughs> I almost regret giving the other one a ten because I don't know if we would need to readjust. Well, I think this is really good. I think it's n not quite as good as the other drink. Good enough to um, round up from 9.83265731. Numbers! Call now to talk to Review Bra. <laughs> Dude. Hello, everyone. Please stop calling me. <laughs> How? All right. So our plan is to gain popularity by mentioning all the popular YouTube <laughs> channels and hashtag all of them. <laughs> And maybe they'll like us and not murder us in our sleep. <laughs> this is the murder review. <laughs> as far as breaking in, it was pretty easy. The uh, I'll give, I'll give the break weak. in a, a 7.23 in terms of overall difficulty. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I've already broken into this place once. Suppose I shouldn't advertise that on YouTube. But... The way that I broke in is no longer accessible. Well, there we go. Because we removed the um, the, 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 the air conditioners. Yep. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Foiled it, again, it. bitches! So, 
You seem to be pounding through this much faster than the coffees. Yeah, well, this, you know, is actually pleasant. It's not coilingly sweet. It is sweet, though. I will give it that. But it's... I bet it would taste good with vodka. It would. Actually, no, I think this is a more of a tequila thing because it's making me think tequila sunrise. Yeah, I can see that. So, uh, distributors, get off your ass and bring this to Vermont. Please. I don't want to have to go back to Rhode Island to get it. Same, I will. Same with the mango orange passion fruit. Get those drinks up here. And not just like up here, to the Burlington area. Because apparently some of these have made their way to St. Albans, but not here. They're uh, skipping uh, us. They're, I mean, maybe Brad. They don't Brown want us too. to have the knowledge. They, they don't underestimate us. our power. They don't want us to have the energy to write our letters of complaint about not being able to have the energy. I knew it. It's another fucking conspiracy. Yep. <coughs> Well, the one thing that's not a conspiracy is just how tasty this Ew. drink is. Oh, that wasn't tasty at all. How did you get coffee in it? I did! <laughs> oh my god, it's coffee and oranges and the worst of both and a little bit of stomach acid. And ah, I give that one a negative poo. All right, well, I guess that's a, a note for us going forward if we're going to do I'm going to make my own energy back. drink. Don't. Ah. Uh, just don't do a, a coffee or a cream <laughs> review and then do an acidic oh, fruit review. Because you have a nice, foamy, cheesy, curdled mess in your stomach. It's like when L.A. Beast ate 13 bananas and drank four liters of Sprite. Oh, well, one and a half. Uh, two, two and a half. He made it most of the way down. Oh. All right, that's three YouTubers we've mentioned during this one video. And our number one fan, Josh, has just launched his own YouTube series. So go uh, go check his channel out. He is at cpgeek.org. That's his YouTube username. So he's uh, doing unboxing and gear videos. So yes. give him some love as well because he gives plenty to us. And it's the least we can do. Um, he's either our first or second biggest fan. Well, who else would, would it be? Uh, Carol or Matt. Or uh, Chris the Lamp. Or Chris. Yeah. We have fans. Four of them. <laughs> yeah. Well, somebody's watching them. All right. Well, down to scoring. Um, this is really good. Mm. As I said, it's not. It's not quite as brilliantly perfect as the mango orange passion fruit. It's a little bit more um, on the sweet side. It is, and also. Unlike the mango orange passion fruit in terms of pure preference, this is a full sugar beverage and mm. not a, uh, a zero carb beverage. Keeping all of that um, in mind, I think I'm going to go with a 9.5. That's exactly where I was shooting. Mm -hmm. This is, uh, in, its, in its silver corrugated steel can, it is the silver metal to the mango orange passion fruit. This is a brilliant drink. It's just got a couple of small dings against it, but again, it's, it's nothing that would turn anybody off to the drink, I don't mm -hmm. think. So if you can find this, definitely check it out. Rockstar is really hitting hard lately, and it shows. I mean, we I just hope need to they've get been the hitting hard. We don't know when here. they come out because we don't see them. It's like a wall of monster wherever we go, which isn't it is like, bad. In, in some but... place, it, it seems like Monster has even overtaken some of the, the Red Bull section, which I think is great. Yeah. But still, like, there's so much which Monster. Which we still haven't reviewed. <laughs> But I think uh, having two drinks in me at this point is all I can stand before I just hummingbird myself away. <laughs> yep. All right. So 9.5 for Rockstar Juiced Energy Tropical Passion Fruit. Mm -hmm. Energy plus juice. Check it out if you can. If you like this video, make sure you give us a thumbs up. Give us a thumbs down if you didn't or, you, you know, you're just a dick. But, hey, that's what it's there for. That's freedom of speech and whatnot. You know, for somebody with such small hands, I give an impressive middle finger. <laughs> and as always, feel free to comment down below, give us suggestions for drinks, or let us know what you think if you've had this drink. And uh, we'd be happy to see what you have to say about it. So, this I been, don't think this they're going to say anything except, fuck, that's awesome. <laughs> oh! All right, Too so. Too much power! I have uh, about a third of this drink left to finish, bad. so I'm going to go do that. I'm going to down this. And I'm going to burp some more. Me too. 
All right. Until next and time, we are burping. I'm Eric the Red. I'm Richard. <laughs> this has been <laughs> news for the caffeinated. Oh, God. I just got some of that coffee up, too. Oh, 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 oh. oh. Oh, it, it burns and it, ugh. That's like, oh. It's like when you work at a gas station, you have to take out the trash cans and they're full of old coffee and cigarette butts. Ugh. My trash is full of cheese. Oh, it's all full of cheese. Okay, I guess we're done here.